Hey traders, Steven Kowitzel here with thetradersplan.com. Today in this video, I am going to teach you how to build a stock watch list in five minutes or less, so stay tuned. Okay, so we're here on stockcharts.com and I'm gonna show you their free tool so everyone can use it. So you go to stockcharts.com. We're gonna scroll down and there's this button right here called the sector summary, right? So we're gonna click on that. And you know, what a sector does on an individual day doesn't really scream a trend to me. So what I like to do is to cut out all the noise, I like to see, okay, where's the money flowing into in the last 30 days? right because I want to buy the strongest stocks in the strongest sectors because there has been research done 40 percent of your stocks performance is based on the sector that it's in so in the last 30 days material sector has clearly outperformed 11.21 percent and you got the utility sectors that is second okay so probably what we're gonna do today is we're gonna pick we're gonna find a few stocks from each sector so that way our watch list is diversified and because you don't want too many you know utility stocks on your watch list or too many material stock you want to have a, a diversified list so what one more thing one more scanner that I really really like to add is even one month isn't a very long trend so I like to kinda add one more filter and see okay I know what's strong on a 30-day basis what's still strong on a three-month basis utilities so what that's telling me right now is utilities is in an intermediate to long-term trend right Whereas materials is more of a very, very short-term trend right now. Utilities isn't a long-term trend. So that gives me more confidence when I'm investing in utilities that it's not just going to be a quick, you know, dead cat bounce type of play that these stocks are moving up and they're moving up nicely. So let's go back to the one month and let's start with materials and we're going to add some utilities sectors in this as well when we are building our stock watch list so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the sector right there now it this material sector is going to take me down to all of the subsectors all the industries within this sector right so what you're going to want to do is you just really want to go to, going to want to go with the best of the best metals right so metals has is up eight 80%, at least this basket of metals is up 80% in the last 30 days. That's pretty strong strength compared to 48% for gold miners. So I'm going to go with the best of the best. Okay, now you have a watch list based on relative strength, so based on performance of all the metals in this industry. So all I'm going to do is say, okay, I'm going to look at the top two or three and add them to my watch list because I want the strongest stocks in the strongest sectors. So you have FCX, Freeport MacMoran, um, TCK, and HBM. So just write those down. I'm going to write those down. FCX, TCK, and HBM. Now I have the three strongest stocks in the whole materials sector combined and in the metals industry as well. So now I have three stocks to my stock watch list. So now let's go back because we don't want all metals stocks in our uh, portfolio. Let's go back and we know that there's a long-term trend in utilities. So let's click on that and let's go find some utility stocks. Now, now we're in the industries. So there's gas utilities, there's electricity utilities, there's water utilities. In the last one month, gas utilities have done the best. So we got to narrow it down somehow. So let's just go with that. So I clicked on that and now I have a very strong list of the top performers in gas utilities. So there's three more names. I'm just, just going to go with three. STR, APU, and PBA. So what we just did in five minutes or less is we broke down the top stocks in the top sectors and then we found the top stocks in the top industries and built a watch list of six names, right? The six strongest names. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something from it. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel if you want to continue to get uh, educational videos. If you are curious on now, you have this these six stocks, you have this watch list, how to narrow it down even further, 
Stay tuned. Hey traders, this is Steven Kowitzel with the TradersPlan.com. I hope you enjoyed my most recent video lesson. There's going to be many more to come. You know, I talk to traders all the time and they keep asking me the same thing. They say, Steven, I really need help timing when to get in a stock and when to get out of stock because I believe I'm losing money when I shouldn't be. So I designed and created the Savvy Trader course to really help you pinpoint with accuracy what is the best time to get in and out of a stock or ETF that gives you the highest probability of success. And as a bonus video, I want to show you one quick trick. It's really, really easy to show you how to pick the exact bottom in a stock or an ETF. So click the button below or to the left or to the right of this video. I don't know where it's at. Just click it and get your free copy of the Savvy Trader course. I'll see you on the inside.